Hey everyone, this is Tony from Pocket. Now we have lost count of the videos, but we have still one more for you. We didn't want to leave without looking at another Galaxy product. We don't usually cover DSLR cameras on Pocket now, but this is a camera which is from the Galaxy family and runs Android. This is the Samsung Galaxy NX. And once we get the screen back, you'll see that this is the preferred operating system on Samsung's DSLR. As the camera is starting up, let's run through the specifications real quick. This is a 4.8 inch HD super clear LCD screen. It's running Android 4.2.2 and it has two gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabytes of internal storage. The camera itself is a 20.3 megapixel camera and it is powered by a 4,360 milliamp hour battery. Of course, radios include LTE connectivity as well as 3G connectivity for those who don't live in LTE markets. Wi-Fi AVGN, also Bluetooth 4.0. And with a swipe, we can get back to the Android menu, which is just your basic Android operating system. Going in for the applications, you can, of course, spot all the icons which are familiar to you by now from uh, from smartphones or from tablets you can install more from the uh, uh, google play store and you can of course always jump back to the home screen by using these persistent buttons jumping back to the camera this is where samsung did some modifications we have the mode selectors uh, we have user specific menus for modes like manual shutter priority, aperture priority, program mode, and of course the palette, which brings you the Samsung specific modes. There are a ton, I believe about 30 or 32 modes. The camera also suggests modes for your specific shooting scenarios. We're not gonna go into any more details. It's just interesting to see Android being the platform powering a DSLR camera, which also happens to have interchangeable lens with compatibility with all other Samsung NX cameras. This was Anton Denied, probably leaving London. And uh, thank you very much for watching, as always. Bye-bye.